Hello guys and welcome to Battle Cats. So I've watched a lot of people play this game. I've played it myself on my tablet mostly and I've well I've not gotten very far but I've gotten to a place that takes some time to reach and seeing so many people record it on YouTube or at least a couple of pretty big YouTubers made me want to play it as well. Well play it, record it and well since it's basically it depends on your device. I have to start over. I mean, technically you can just give in the code and just continue your progress, but I figured it would be better for recording and more fun to just do it from scratch. So I'm just going to start a new game and hopefully can, we can have some fun with this. Oh man, I forgot how Okay, need to make that a little bit more quiet. I forgot how little energy you have when you start. Yes, yes, I know how the money works. I heard somebody say that you can actually, if you're on the PC version, you can actually bind like these cats and things to buttons or something like that, but I'm not sure how that's supposed to work right now. I'm just going to have to deal with the fact that I have to click on everything. I mean, I made it so that you can't see my mouse, but yeah, I have to click every time I want to send a cat. Which isn't ideal. So, uh, the game, game audio is really loud for me. Okay, well, yeah, let's upgrade that so we get money faster. The game audio is really loud for me and I'm not sure if it's going to be really loud for you guys, so if this episode turns out to be way too quiet for you guys, then I'm sorry, and I'll turn it up for next time. It's going to be a bit of a learning process. I'm not going to use the cat cannon, because as you can see, the range right now isn't very impressive, it only goes to here. Wait, what am I doing? I should spam the kitties. There's no reason not to spam them. Come on, more cats. I'm actually being pushed back on the first level. That's not acceptable. Well, it's probably because I stopped sending cats to talk. That's not a good idea. I need to get better at multitasking. There we go, now we're finally starting to hit the base. Come on, bite, 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 bite. How much damage do they actually do per hit? That's kind of hard to see when there's like 50 of them biting it at the same time. No, not really a lot though. Come on, almost halfway. The poor dogs are just getting knocked back. And almost there. Da, 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 da. Ooh, sweet. We, we actually got superior treasure from the get go. That is really good. The item shop is now open. You can buy many useful items in battle, catnip challenges. Not 100% not sure what catnip challenges are. Uh, for people not familiar with this game, Cat food, this stuff here that I just got is like the premium currency of the game. You picked a rare ticket. Uh, okay, no thanks, whatever that is. So rare tickets, you sometimes get them from these missions here. Oh, go away. No, pretty clear, you do something, you get a reward. It's not always going to be cat food, sometimes it's upgrades or experience or whatever. Oh, I don't have it open. There's another way to earn cat food that I don't have yet. Treasures it basically, like this thing that I just got. You can, you have a chance of getting them when you complete the level. There's three qualities, which is inferior, normal, and superior. If you have all these, like all superior for this, this activates, you get a certain boost. And the boost has an effectivity. If you have all golden, it's going to be 100%, but if you have silver and bronzes, it's not going to be at full power, so 
you want to grind to 100%. There are ways to increase your chances of getting the one you want, though. Okay, store. Okay, yeah, this is basically like a little boost in the game that you can buy with cat food, which I am not going to do. Besides, I can't even afford anything in here. <laughs> Uh, the ticket that I just gotten, I cannot use yet. Uh, what is this? Oh, right. When you start the game, you get an option to buy one of these. I mean, they say like that is great value and everything, but still, that's the thirty dollars is still a lot if you ask me. So whether I'll buy any of that or not. I do not know yet. Either way though, let's get Tank Cat. He's just a, a big ol' sausage cat. So I'll give... Wait, I was going to give them both a level, but I don't have enough experience. Uh, I can't upgrade Worker Cat Rate, which is a very important one. It basically means that your money goes up faster during a battle. Uh, can I... No, I was going to upgrade this one study, but I can't afford that either. I could do one of these two, but they're not that important. Wait, do I have no Oh! There was actually a mission to do the upgrade. I am probably going to save this cat food, but I'll explain why I'm doing that once we unlock it. Wait, what does that do? Lock items. Keep them in use. Yeah, if you have it locked and for, for example you have one of these and you turn it on, it'll automatically have it on for each level. Th this has made me on my tablet version waste so many of these upgrades. Well, not really upgrades. Boosts. Come on, I need more money. If you can't hear the end game sounds, but you can hear the music, that's because the music was either on or off and it was too loud to me, so instead I've added the music in post. Like for me there's no music right now, but you are obviously hearing music. That's because I added it afterwards. I mean, I might just do a couple of test recordings with the music on, but for some reason it always seems to drown out my voice. Which kind of sucks, because there's a lot of levels that have like their own unique music. But, you know, if I can find, figure out how to fix it, then I definitely will. There we go. The big ol' sausage cat on the little feet. Don't ask me how those feet are able to carry that weight, because I do not know. This time we're actually going to keep spamming cats, keep them on their toes. And a lot of the harder levels, the usual strategy would be to first upgrade these workers to their max level, which is level 8, then wait till your max cache is full, and then just spam your most powerful units. But we only have two units, and as you can see, it's not really necessary. This guy, the tank cat, does almost no damage, but as, it, as his name suggests, he can take a lot of damage. <gasps> Inferior pasta. I mean, it's better than nothing. Yeah, so now you can see in, this is inferior, the bronze one, normal is the silver, and superior is the gold. Yeah, it keep, well, it probably keeps doing that because I have something unlocked, but I don't have access to it yet because I need to get further in the game. It's kind of like a weird little bug. Not not sure why it works this way, but it does. Uh, boop. We'll just hop right into China. I kind of want to, before I f finish this first episode, at the very least, I want to open that cat ticket. And uh, are you? Yeah, I'll do one more level, and then I'll start spamming when he gets close to my base. Go ahead. Oh god, money goes up so slowly. On my tablet I have a lot of things active that boost how fast the money goes up, so 
this feels incredibly slow to me. Okay, so tank cat. Come on, tank cat alone isn't going to do much. He's going to need fire support. I don't think I re I'm really going to need more than one tank cat as long as I keep pumping out these guys. You do get money for defeating enemies yet, but like many other things that can be upgraded, so right now I don't think that's going to be a lot of money. There we go, we'll send out another tank cat, because why not? I mean, this, this guy is only level 2, so he's not going to last all that long. Well, at least there's going to be no bosses yet. Well, I say bosses, a lot of levels have like really strong units that can pop out if you start hurting the base. But I don't think that's going to happen for the first few levels. But that's one of the reasons you want to have like your money full and be ready for a big scent of cats before you start hitting the base. Because if, you, if you're not prepared and you're still too weak, then the boss popping out, or mini boss, whatever you want to call it, is just going to ruin your life. Like I'm ruining these guys' lives. <laughs> Sadly, we did not get a treasure this time. Uh, but we did get Axe Cat, Combat Maniac, strong against red enemies. There's enemy types, well, I can't filter yet, but there's enemy types, and if they're, colored, if they're colored threat, that means Axe Cat over here is going to be powerful against them. Uh, so, I am actually going to do this, a bit of a long-term investment. This, and this. No. Tank Cat is going to be fine for now. Next up is Thailand, famous for... Wait, isn't that the country that's so known because you can have a lot of women there that are actually men and you wouldn't be able to tell the difference? Or am I thinking of the wrong country? Also food. A lot of Thai food. Although I don't think I've ever eaten it. Come on, give me money faster. I am going to be so happy when I get my efficiency upgraded. Wait, I'm gonna let that cat do his thing for a bit. He should be fine for a little while. Right? While I upgrade my money. Okay, I think I'm going to need to give him some reinforcements. He doesn't seem to be doing as well as I thought, and he's dead. Uh, let's send you. I can use the cat cannon. There we go. In, a, in later waves it doesn't really kill all the enemies, but you can upgrade the range a lot, and it's usually pretty handy to interrupt the attacks from big enemies. There's different up sort of upgrades you can do to the cat base specifically, but those are only going to be unlocked way later on. Okay, boop. Boop. Send, send another combo out. Ooh, actually, I'm going to send an axe cat out. I mean, I don't think there's going to be any red enemies here, but why not? Just a little bit further. I always have the urge to instantly press the fire button on levels where I know there's not going to be a boss like this. But I don't have the range yet, so it would be pointless. Ooh. They do seem to do a lot more damage now. I wish it would actually tell me how much more damage they do. 
If you enter battle within 10 seconds of entering combat, energy spent will be restored. Oh yeah, this is for in case you go into a level and then decide like, oh shit, I don't want to do this. If you immediately back out within those 10 seconds, you get your energy back. Also, I remember that if you do this enough, apparently you can unlock a cat. Come on, give me... Come on, uh, give, give me that cat, god damn it. Uh. Oh, leave me alone, help text bubble, I want to see what this is. Okay guys, I give up. Apparently if you manage to do that a hundred times within minutes, which should be pretty easy, yet I'm still failing. You unlock a cat. It's not a particularly strong cat, but you know, it's another cat to have. I really do, my fingers were getting tired, so I'm going to admit defeat there for right now. It's a lot easier to do when you can use your finger. Boop. We'll send out a father cat to buy us some time. And if you can't kill that snake, then the money from killing that snake is going to help out as well. You know what, we'll even give him a friend. A lot of these levels will send out a bunch of stuff at the beginning to trick you into sending like a really big counter force. Then they'll send nothing, your units hit the base, out pops a big defense force because you hit the enemy base. And you're not ready to defend yet, and that's how they defeat you. Talking about defeating. There are way too many of you and I would like you to stop. Protect my units, tank cat. Or we can do, just do that. Yeah, that works. <gasps> little dudes. Little, little humans. They're actually, despite not looking like it, I'm pretty sure that out of all the units on screen, these little guys are the strongest ones. Don't ask me how that works. I don't know. There we go, now we can just spam units and we should be fine. Please don't make me a liar. My tank cat. I need more tank cats. I only have two left. God, God damn it, I had the urge to fire again, but no dice. It wouldn't actually help me. Come on guys, destroy that before the tank cat dies. Come on. You know what, I, I think we're going to be fine. Even if we could kill the cats, uh, the tank cats, we have so many regular cats now. And there we go. I'm actually going to see if I can upgrade my work cat rate. There we go, we can upgrade it twice. Now that means my units aren't going to be as strong as they could have been if I upgraded them. But it also means I get to spam more. Okay, next up is the Philippines, which I know absolutely nothing about. Apparently they have something to do with bananas. Yeah, I, I don't know. Don't, don't, don't ask. A boop. Boop. There we go. These two should be able to hold the enemy off for a while. Money does come in a little faster now, as you can see. This is going to speed things up. Maybe I should upgrade that thing that gives me more money for defeating enemies next. Oh, I need to upgrade my max money. I literally can't upgrade past this level right now. That's an oopsie. I did not think I would run into that problem. 
please tell me that my cats are strong enough to actually get through this level. It would be pretty depressing if I couldn't do that. But I think we're still going to be fine for now just because we have so many tanks built up. And a couple of axe cats. I don't know if against non-red enemies the axe cats are weaker than the macho cats or not, but right now I just need more cats. No, more numbers. There we go. Oh yeah, that base is definitely not going to live for very long. Kill it before they kill my tanks. Please. There we go. Inferior banana. Just like one of those really brown bananas because it's been in the fruit bowl for way too long. Special cats. Oh yeah, I forgot about these. You unlock them now and then. They're sometimes pretty good, but... I'm not going to waste cat food on that, I want to save my cat food. We also have cat god here, which is, well, could potentially be handy, but right now I think I need to spend that experience on other things. Uh, worker cat wallet, that's, that's definitely something I need. And we have gross cat, which, you know what, I don't think he's gross, but he's definitely weird. Um, hmm. There we go, we'll, we'll give tank cat a level. And we don't actually have enough to upgrade the regular cats. Can we upgrade the wallet again? No. Uh, let's research production speed. Uh, when you aren't defeating an enemy. Sure. We'll upgrade the level of accounting. That'll also let us spam more. And now you go to Japan, home of the anime. I don't know a lot about Japanese culture, just that they make anime. A lot of it. Come on. I'm going to try and just get as many levels as I can before I'm forced to send out something. Can I get another one? No. We'll just send a little duo out to slow them down. I mean, I did upgrade the regular cat so, and the tank cat, so hopefully they'll last a little longer this time. Okay, send out another one of these guys to help out. You know what, and now we'll send nothing. If they get too far, they'll be all bunched up and I can just cat cannon them. I want to save my money right now. Come on guys, yeah, go ahead, kill my cats. I don't mind. Go for it. See what happens. And boom. Excuse you. You weren't supposed to survive. Go away. How dare you. Okay, now I'm going to save for a gross cat. At the very least, I want to be able to show him off. Or it. No, I was just going to say him. This game likes to mess with you a lot with certain characters, which is what you're going to see later on in the series. And here in all his glory is gross cat. I don't know why that's gross. It looks weird, but I don't think he's gross. He's a beautiful, beautiful long boy. Why am I waving my mouse over him as if you can see it? I forgot that I hit my mouse. I just have a tendency to move my mouse around a lot, even when it's not necessary. And I figured that would annoy some people. Boop. Boop. 
Hippo. Is it a hippo? I think it's a hippo. My English isn't perfect. But yeah, Gross Cat is basically like a cat that's it's long range, so he's going to sit in the back and whack at people. Okay, I need that hippo to die. He's pushing my units back. That's not okay. I keep, I keep wanting to fire my cat cannon to help, but it can't. Not yet. Well, eventually the cat cannon, at least the basic cat cannon, is more useful for the knockback than anything else. Come on, kill the hippo. There we go. We could even send out another gross cat. But with the hippo dead, there's not really anything that can stop our advance. I don't think is he going to get there before they kill the tower or whatever this is. Yes, he is. Ooh, superior. I'm actually getting pretty decent luck. You unlocked the cat seeker. Filter through and inspect all cats you've picked up. New event stage has been released. Cat capsule machine has been unlocked. User rank unlocked. Officer's club. And more cat food. Ooh, 100 free cat food. Oh, this that's from an event. It's going to give me a bunch of free stuff. Ooh, hell yeah. That is a lot of free experience. That's going to help a lot, actually. <laughs> Holy shit, that is a lot of experience, actually. No, 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 no. Okay, I don't think I can do this yet. Uh, ticket. Oh yeah, I'm kind of tempted to get it. No, I'll explain what that platinum ticket is later, but I have a lot of things to explain right now. This first episode is going to be really long, just because I want to. Well, I wanted to get to this point basically. So, cat guide should go away. Basically, this shows you all the cats you've unlocked. They go from normal to rare. Or, okay, rare is ranked after special. So, normal, special. Special are those cats that you have to unlock with cat food and certain cats that you unlock through special means. Then you have rare, super rare, uber super rare. And I think there's like a sort of uber type that's called legendary uber super rare or something like that but i've never gotten one of those and if you unlock a cat and you click on it it gets you five free cat foods so they they try to encourage you to actually look at what each unit is good at Wait, what does this mean oh right strong against threat he's not strong against anything but he's a boy with a long range Wait, what else? Officer's Club. I don't actually know what this is and I don't care to find out. If it's worth having, feel free to let me know. Not 20 for Japan. Wait, did I? Do I have another mission? No, it's just added missions. It also lets you know when you have new missions. We'll open these four because uh, the silver ones mostly contain the basic cats, like the common cats and things like this, base upgrades. Okay, power. Free axe cat. And finally, uh, which one are you? Study. I think that's the one that gives you more for defeating an enemy. Anyway, if you don't immediately use them all, they go into here. You can exchange them for experience, which generally is a bad idea. You can also just do use all. And these are kind of special if you get them through this way, because now, basically if I go to this guy, 
He's still level 1, but he has plus 1. It's like a bonus level of sorts. I don't know if there's like a li limit to how many bonus levels they can have, but now he's basically, despite still being level 1, he's equal to level 2, and if I upgrade him now, this will say 2, but he'll be equal to level 3. It's kind of like 3 levels in, in the beginning. Uh, okay, so this is basically the rear capsule machine. These are special cats. These are all the ones you see here are all the Ubers. And these are some super rares you can win. Come on, shimmy, 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 shimmy. Ooh. I kind of want this one. This one looks really cool. Just a giant neck. Uh, this is actually huge super rare five percent. That's okay, I guess. So you can use cat food either to open this, or you can use these tickets. Now I wouldn't recommend like this event. I wouldn't do it. It'll change in a day, but sometimes it does events where there, where there's a hundred percent chance to get at least one Uber, which is basically the last one you'll draw. And especially in the beginning, you get one try where it's. As you can see, it's only 750. That doesn't go away, so if I were you, I would wait for that. Okay, guys, I need to dip out real fast because I'm kind of sick, but either way, to continue where I left off, basically, like I said, you can get, well, special cats here, small chance to get the Ubers that are on here, which ones you get changes a lot, but I, I'm not sure, but I think the very first one you open is always going to be an Uber, kind of to get you hooked, so... I'm going to kind of take Chauzy, if I'm saying that right, which is another YouTuber that did a Battle Cat series. I'm going to, going to take his ID, where he basically saved up his cat tickets till there was a really good event that he wanted and he opened like hundreds of tickets in a stream i don't know if i'm going to do a stream yet if i get to that point or just a video but i'm going to open up one to see if that guaranteed uber when on the very first try is true and then i'm going to save these tickets come on Okay, I guess it is not true, but we did get a super rare, so it could be worse. We will use you. But, oh, okay. Well, let's get, go take a look at our little guy that we unlocked. Uh, yeah, yeah, I don't know how to organize it. Cat toaster is 800. I always... Like, put my, order my cats by how much they cost. Maybe that's not the best idea, but whatever. It's fine for now. And we'll look into the cat library, what it's all about. Boop. And yeah, he's a super rare, so rare. Rare, super rare. There he is. He's a, he's a little toaster guy. Fed up with making toast every day, went on strike by firing bread at dad's face. Might slow angelic enemies. That's pretty cool. Well, there are no angelic enemies yet, and I don't know if he's considered to be good or not, but... Area of attack sounds pretty good, so we'll use him for now. Now, a cool thing I should be able to do before I end the episode with the experience that we got from that event. Yes, yeah, super rare, I know, I just looked at him. Stop doing the new thing. I think we can max this guy out and... <gasps> you know what, no. I'm going to make you wait. Next episode, the first thing I'm going to do is upgrade Cast to level 10. At which point he will undergo a transformation. What is that transformation? Well, if you've seen or played Battle Cats, you already know, but just in case for the people that don't know yet, I'll keep this as a spoiler. I am actually going to dump the rest of that experience into Worker Cat Raid. There we go. We'll do another. We'll bring this to level 5. There we go. We'll upgrade these. 
And now I'm just going to max out. Well, I don't have enough to max out, but upgrade max cat energy so we don't run out of energy while we're trying to record. And no, might as well. Oh wait, no, 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 no. I almost upgraded him. We're going to wait for that. We'll give Axe Cat a level, and the rest we'll keep for later. I'm sorry I wasn't able to show you guys an Uber, but with a little luck I should be able to save up my cat food. Actually, I forgot about the Platinum Ticket. So they very rarely sell these, and the Platinum Ticket basically means uh, a guaranteed Uber Rare. But the Platinum Ticket is special in the way that it's not from the current event, like the current thing that you saw in the shop. Platinum Ticket can be an Uber Rare, any Uber Rare in the game. You literally don't know what you'll be getting. So, since this channel is tiny, I'm just going to set a very modest goal. If I can get 5 likes, just 5 on this video, despite it being a little bit of a mess with me being sick, then I will bl buy, yes, I will buy it. I will buy the platinum tickets and open it in the next video. Other than that though, thank you for watching the video. I know it wasn't ideal, but that's mostly because I'm a little bit sick. Either way though, I hope you still enjoyed and I will hopefully see you in the next video I make. Peace out.